Greetings and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Nox, The Wizard's Way. And we're pretty much at the final part. Know your limits, mortal. You're on my land now. Meddle any further into my business and you'll pay with your life. <laughs> Blink! Uh, probably more useful than uh, telekinesis. Obliteration. Yeah, that's pretty much the only use you have for that. That's a trap spell. Um, I'll put that in there. Because that's how we're gonna beat Hecuba. Cannot see that spot, alright then. Done. And the description for Blink is a little, little bit hazy. <laughs> Right then. Run while you can, Pop. Orvath was a true master, and I dealt with him handily. Had he taught you all he knew, your cause would still be hopeless. Run now, boy, and I might grant you a year of peace, or face me and suffer eternal darkness. I'll face you and suffer eternal darkness. Hey. I'm not calling on my B team to fight my battles, come on. Where did Hecuba go? That spell is cheating. Uh. I think I just I think she just activated Oblivion. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't really help me. I don't suppose I can break these walls. No, nope, doesn't look like it. Oops. Uh, she teleported away. Now, Oblivion is quite cool to look at, but you can't stand anywhere near it, so it's a bit difficult to show. Where did she go? Done. 
Like I said, quite neat. But problem is, I'm actually missing a spell. Yeah, that's nice. Not need really what I wanted. Because as you can see, Hecuba has the annoying uh, desire to blink away whenever she's in trouble. And that doesn't really help me defeat her. Now there is a spell that would allow me to block her teleportation ability, but I, I can't remember where it is. Yikes. <laughs> How many fireballs has she eaten in the face already? Ouch. Unfortunately, I can't really reflect that. Or return to center. Yikes! Ah, I got her. Poor Beth was a poor teacher if this is the best you can muster. I hope you're a quick learner. Try this one for size. What? No! It's not possible! Humbled by this off-world mortal! This truth is the bitterest of foul poisons to end like this! Welcome to the land of the dead, mortal. You sure fit right in. <laughs> Looks to me like you need a little more warm up. Home run! Not bad, but it lacks a certain spark of creativity. Is that the best you can do? Oh no, not by a long shot.
Marshal! I might ask you the same question. You're not from around here. No, but I'm beginning to like it. Ah, a very satisfying ending. The one time you actually see uh, Jack portrayed as an actually cool character. Using the almighty staff of being able to f fend off anything that Hakiba throws at me. Still, the wizard battle is definitely more fun than the warrior battle. And not quite as tricky as when fighting with a conjurer, I think. Mostly because the conjurer doesn't really have any direct damage spells you can just throw out. Mostly just hoping that you can hit something with the bow and arrows. But well... This... This has been my playthrough of Nox in all three paths. Unless, of course, this is the first one you've seen, and then... You might want to go on to the others to see how I completed those. Uh, I hope I showed you a way of playing it. I'm fairly certain I missed lots of stuff and I definitely didn't play to the best of my ability. Uh, alas, it's been a long time since I played this game for the first time and the enthusiasm hasn't quite remained the same. Not sure why that is. But still, I find it's a very good game and I had hoped to see more of it. Maybe the world fleshed out some more. Even more to explore. But as it stands, it is a decent game. Anyway, I have been Leo, the Lurking Lion. And I thank you for watching. See you all next time, probably in another game. Goodbye.